Well, think of all the information you can get now online. Right. Criminal and civil records, real estate records, divorce records. But want to check to see if someone is already married? Yeah, it's a little more difficult. Tonight, the 11 News IT team uncovers a rare case of bigamy here in Maryland. And the trouble you have to go through to discover if someone is already married. Here's lead investigative reporter Jane Miller. You might call Deshaun Valentine the marrying kind. Certainly no crime in that, except he's been married to two or more women at the same time. So he seemed like oh no, the real deal. Yes. We won't identify the woman who agreed to speak with us. We're using a fictitious name, Chanel. She met Valentine through an online dating site. Who brought up the topic of marriage? He did. Chanel and Valentine married in December of 2011. She says it seemed like a good fit until the following year at the Thanksgiving holiday when she says he invited her to his family dinner but then didn't post. I went and he never showed up. At all? At all. His family was there. His family was there, yes. But he wasn't. But he did not attend. He didn't return her calls either, Chanel says. So she went through the records of their shared phone account and started calling the most frequently dialed numbers. One went to a woman in Prince George's County. I said, hello, my speaker to Sean. And she said, he's not here. Who is this? And I told her. And she said, oh, my God, oh, my God. And I said, is something wrong? Who are you? And she said, she's his wife. So that's when you realized he was married to two women exactly. at the same time. Exactly. The woman in PG County married Valentine in January of 2010. She was unaware that almost two years later, Valentine also married Chanel. Why, you ask? Wouldn't someone check to see if the person they're about to marry might already be married? It's not that easy. While you can see divorce records online through the state's judiciary case search, there is no online database of marriage licenses. You've got to go to the courthouse in person and ask the clerk to look up the information. The whole process relies on the honor system. The marriage certificate in Chanel's case lists Deshaun Valentine as single. There was no one to check if that was true. Our search through a court clerk shows Deshaun Valentine's had 10 wives since 1998. Four of the marriages ended in divorce or annulment records show the rest appear to still be on the books. Are you Mr. Valentine? Yes. In January, Deshaun Valentine pleaded guilty to the crime of bigamy, one of the rare times such a case has been prosecuted in Maryland. Oh, my God. Mr. Valentine, how come you married all these women? Off camera, Valentine disputed the validity of at least two marriages. Several marriages were recorded in Washington County, where Valentine served a lengthy sentence for armed robbery. What's his motive? Last December, a woman from Washington accused him of using marriage to get money from her. He took her to the federal courthouse, she said, in a charging document, and had told her, I might have to show some form of assets so it doesn't look like he's paying me to marry him. The woman said they were there to get a marriage license, but the federal courts don't issue marriage licenses. Valentine used the ruse, she said, to take from her $30,000. He denies the charge. A few months after his conviction for bigamy, Valentine went to an Eastern Shore court to change his name. He also met a new woman on the shore. A few weeks ago, her Facebook page showed the two were engaged. Those pictures have since been taken down. For the 11 News I team, I'm Jane Miller.